So for this next segment, what I want to do is introduce my colleague, Morton Nielsen. And as he comes up to the stage, um, there are times where ESRI really likes to have a little bit of fun. And with that, we came up with a cool idea. And this, this idea, I don't know, Morton, maybe you want to tell us a little bit about your cool idea here. Sure. Does anyone know the Kinect? A few? Xbox, yes. OK. So we, we took that idea and see, could we do something with a map? So I have an app running here. You can see up on the screen, it kind of sees me as a blue guy. Art is red, I think. Yeah. Um, I'm just going to make a quick pose until I want to take control here. And you can now see my face up here, too. Right. So what he's doing right now is he's registering himself with the Kinect controller, with this application. And this application is a version 2.2 version of our WPF API. Yes? What he's doing, thank you. This is awesome stuff. And quite honestly, what he's doing right here is he's navigating the map with just hand gestures. You'll see that his, his color frame for his image in the upper right-hand corner dictates the hand color that he's, that he's operating the map with. So as he selects a different tool, in this case, he selected the view shed, he's executing a GP analysis tool. Simultaneously, he wants to uh, select redlining. He can do redlining all the above. Now, if this isn't cool, I don't know what is. This is an exercise of natural user interface, right? So yes, we have fun at ESRI, too. Not just a lot of work. So yeah, good old wraparound. All right, thank you. We're, oh, we're not quite sure what we want to do with this technology yet, but um, you got to admit, possibilities are endless. Thanks, Jim. Thanks, Art. Thanks, Martin.